Hatfield set here for rows five and fifth grade. Away they go, jumping out wide, Miss Verity quickly away. Henrik Bales shows speed and drive and forward Prince of Ligon. They go into that first corner and Prince of Ligon slides up to take the lead. In second place, Miss Verity. Uh, Henrik Bale nice and handy in third, then followed by Jazz Party. Further back, Swift Shani. Squamish next and followed by I'm Not Barry and My Envy last of all. The leader, Prince of Ligon. Out wide, Macon Ground, Henrik Bale, then followed by Miss Verity. Further back, we had Jazz Party, then followed by Swift Shani onto the corner. Prince of Ligon is still the leader. Trying hard. There was Jazz Party. Went straight past the Jazz Party and went to the lead and dashed away to win. Uh, Prince of Ligon got second, then followed by Henrik Bale third, then followed by Swift Shani. Further back, Miss Verity. Squamish next. Well back, I'm not Barry. My envy. Last in. Yeah, Jazz Party gets up. Went well over the journey for the first time last time. When second behind Prince of Ligon, just missed out, but went straight past them once they straightened Jazz Party to go on score well. Time is 37.97. And uh, 4, 6, 2 and 3. 4, 6, 2 and 3. Prince of Ligon second, Henrik Bale third. And Swift Shani. So four lengths by one and a quarter. 37.97 for the winner, Jazz Party for Mark Partland. Prince of Ligon, second, Brad Belfort. Two third, Henrik Bale. John La Rosa from three, Swift Sharney. So the time is 37.97. And Jazz Party a little bit too good here in the fifth race over the 6.43, racing away for a good win. Scoring by four lengths in the end, one and a quarter between second and third, 37.97, 4.623 the numbers, race five.